The oldest nine judge bench case at the Supreme Court is about minerals. Diamonds in the sand. Yes, minerals. Those precious elements you find in the ground. The crux of the case? Who should have the power to collect tax on them? The central government or state governments? The story began in 1957. The Mines Act determined the royalty that has to be paid by a leaseholder of the mine to the landowner. Things began to stir when a Tamil Nadu law charged an additional cess other than royalty. India Cement, a public mining company, went to the Supreme Court. They asked, why did they have to pay up twice? The court said that royalty is a tax and therefore the state cannot levy additional cess in the name of taxes. For years, cases were decided based on this judgment. But there was an alleged mistake, a typographical error. Instead of writing royalty is a tax, the court was meant to write that the cess on the royalty is a tax, which the state government was not competent to impose. The result? Years of cases started piling up like a bad traffic jam. Currently, Jharkhand alone, one of the largest mining states, owes Rs 10,588 crores in taxes. On 14th March 2024, the Supreme Court reserved judgment on the matter. It has been around 50 years since the case opened.